Dad? Did you want to see me? Yes, come in, sir. What's up? I want to ask you a question, Ridge, and I want you to think long and hard before you give me an answer. Are you certain, really certain, you're ready for marriage? Well, would you like to answer me? No, actually, I wouldn't. It's a very simple question, actually. One that implies I don't know what I'm doing? I don't mean to imply that, son. Then why did you ask? You didn't have second thoughts when you married Mother? Second thoughts? <laughs> yes. But I knew I was ready to get married. I just want to be certain that you are, too. Well, I'm as ready as I'll ever be, Dad. This young woman you're marrying, she's, uh, she's very special. Yes, I know. Her family, her, her, her upbringing, everything about her impresses me. Then you know why I'm marrying her. Is that why? Part of it. Well, what else? Isn't it obvious? Ridge, you've known a lot of beautiful women. What made Caroline stand out? Why do I get this feeling that it's, uh, you're not so much concerned about me as you are about Caroline? Caroline's innocent. She's innocent, she's fragile, she's vulnerable. She obviously worships the ground you walk on. She is not some China doll that's gonna shatter if you drop her. That may be closer to the truth than you know. My fiance has really gotten under your skin. Yes, yeah, she has. She's sensitive, she's a lovely woman. She'll make you a wonderful wife. A wife with whom you can grow as a man. I just want you to be sure. For God's sake, Rich, be sure. Don't worry about me. I'm not worried about you. It's Caroline. I don't want to see her hurt by you. That's what I thought. You must know that it's within you to do that. Dad, if I have to treat my own wife like some fragile package, then I really am in trouble. But that's the beauty of this woman. I would think that would be one of the reasons you're marrying her. Well, it isn't. Well, then let me ask you again. Why are you marrying this girl? You're born, you get married, and you die. What's the big deal? You know, marriage has never been really high on your list of priorities. Now, all of a sudden, you meet this girl and you're engaged to her. I'd just like to know why. Certainly, I assume you love her. Come in. Hello, Caroline. Hello, Mr. Forrester. Hi, darling. Hi, hon. How are you? Thanks for coming, Caroline. Well, my father gave me your message. Oh, I, I enjoyed meeting your father. He's a fine man. Thank you. And he enjoyed meeting you and Mrs. Forrester, too. Well, that's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have much to do and not very much time to do it in. I know. I mean, a week from Friday. I can't believe it. It occurred to me you must miss your mother terribly at a time like this. Yes, I do. I was just thinking about that this morning. And with everything to do, I haven't even picked out my wedding gown yet. Caroline, would you... Would you allow me to help you out with that? Would I? Good. With your approval, this will be your wedding gown. I 
I, I don't know what to say. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Dad Forrester. Thank you. <laughs>